hey what's going on guys let's do this problem right here this question is asking a doubly charged ion with velocity 6.9 times 10 to the power of 6 meter per second moves in a path of radius 30 centimeter in a magnetic field of 0 0.80 tesla in a mass spectrometer what is the mass of this ion and the charge is given by two electrons right and let's see how we can find it so first of all to find this one we have to do something we have to equate the magnetic field and the centripetal force so whenever we have a charged particle in a magnetic field the force is given by bvq sin theta right bvq sin theta and uh, the the charged particle is always going to be perpendicular to magnetic field so the angle is going to be 90 degree so this is going to be sine 90 and that is equal to 1 so we can write just write bvq right here right bvq and another force we are going to have is centripetal force because when when a charged particle go through magnetic field they face deflection and it causes them to move in a circular path so when they move in a circular path they are going to have a centripetal force that's given by, by Fc is equal to mv square over r and both of them are both of the forces are going to be equal so if we equate them from that we can find the mass the mass is the question right so mass of the ion find the mass of the, mass of the ion so let's equate both of them and see what we can get so this here we are going to have mv square over r is equal to bvq and let's separate this mass mass is going to be equal to bvq r over mv square oh we don't need m v square right so here if you if you notice v square and this v cancels and we only get bvq r bq r v already cancelled b q r over the velocity and let's put all the values first we have the magnetic field that is 0 0.8 tesla and the charge is given by two electrons that means one electron charge is so we multiply this one by two one electron charge is 1.6 times 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb and then we have the radius radius is given by 30 centimeter to convert this one into meter we multiply this one by 10 to the power of minus 2 so that's going to give us meter in the denominator we have the velocity and that is equal to 6.9 times 10 to the power of 6 meter per second and if you calculate this one that's going to give you 11 times 10 to the power of minus 27 kilogram and that's going to be the mass of this particle and that's how we do this kind of problems i hope you guys find this video helpful see you next time